Financial analysis is integral to Fitch's corporate rating criteria. The reported financial statements are a source material providing broad indications of an entity's financial position, but they have limitations. Therefore, Fitch adjusts an issuer's reported financial statements to enhance comparability across rated entities. The corporate rating criteria details nine main adjustments which may be applied when material to the analysis. The analysis may also include reclassifying unusual revenues, expenses, or liabilities to better reflect the sustainable risk profile of an issuer. The resulting adjusted financial data forms the starting point of Fitch's financial analysis. Fitch's ratings are forward-looking. Financial forecasts underpin our analysis. An issuer's operating history, its adjusted financial data, and strategic plans are important inputs into the financial forecast scenario. But the use of Fitch's global macroeconomic forecast, sector-specific outlooks, and global commodity price assumptions ensure comparability across issuers. The key financial forecast scenario is called the rating case. The rating case is a set of conservative projections generally developed with a three to five year time horizon, which supplement the last three years of financial data to form the basis of our assessments. Fitch considers this time horizon sufficient to represent one typical economic cycle of the issuer under review. This analysis through the economic cycle is important to reduce rating volatility. The key assumptions applied in each rating case are listed in the rating action commentary. Our analysis relies on a variety of quantitative measures of profitability, leverage, and coverage to assess the financial risk profile. Fitch regards the analysis of trends in a number of ratios as more relevant than any individual ratio, which represents only one performance measure at a single point in time. EBITDA-based credit metrics are emphasized across most sectors. But FFO-based metrics are more relevant in specific sectors, such as utilities and REITs. Similarly, Fitch concentrates on EBITDA-based credit metrics in select sectors where operating leases are more prevalent, such as retail and hotels. Credit metrics are not used in a determinate fashion to assign ratings as varying conclusions can be drawn from the same ratio depending on the sector under review. Fitch's sector navigators specify the financial ratios consistent with the different rating categories for various sectors on a regional or global basis. The financial projections are also used in comparative analysis, where Fitch reviews the financial risk profile of an issuer relative to its peers. This video was a quick overview of financial adjustments, forecasted financials, and credit metrics in the corporate sector. More details are available on our website.